Right, now, one of my main bones of contention with the new Lightroom uh, Classic CC, or CC Classic, I forget which way it goes, um, is this. Here we've got a nice shot of a white-tailed seagull marching over in flight. Um, his name's Miguel, well, that's what we call him anyway. But, um, yeah, we've got some very strong shadows on this bird, but we've got shadow detail as much as we need inside there um yeah but we now have a problem which i didn't have yesterday when i was in lightroom cc um before i upgraded and uh, it's quite simply this if we go over into the develop module oh my god what's happened to the shadows you'll notice if a swing between the um, two modules there is no change in the histogram at all none so it's basically it's a graphics thing it's not a processing thing but of course if we are seeing something that's not actually there we're going to try and overcompensate for it aren't we and uh, yeah this is really really bad on the part of adobe um, can't possibly be anything to do with my system because it wasn't doing it yesterday before I upgraded. So uh, anyway, the one way I found to simply get rid of that is to go over to Lightroom Preferences and simply uncheck Use Graphics Processor QE and now we've got all the shadow detail back again. So uh, there we go. Um, problem i don't know how many people have got this problem i would think more than most because a lot of people never check their images contrast um so you know but there you go if you've got this problem go into your preferences and for the moment you're going to have to uncheck use graphics processor until adobe have actually got their finger out and their act together so uh, there you go i shall see you soon